I was 18 years old when I first saw the Great Barrier Reef in the waters of the Coral Sea, and I was absolutely mesmerised. I did my degree at James Cook University and went right through and finished a PhD there. And since that time, I've been lucky enough to visit reefs from Indonesia to Papua New Guinea, the Solomon Islands, and of course, many places on Australia's Great Barrier Reef. After 30 years, the time has come to wrap all of my experience and knowledge into one project, the Coral Sea Foundation. There are three key things I want to achieve with the Coral Sea Foundation. Firstly, I want to raise awareness of the incredible value of the reefs that we have on our northern doorstep. Not just their economic value, but their ecological value and their aesthetic value. One of the most incredible ecosystems this planet has ever seen. Secondly, we want to help the local people in Melanesia set up marine protected areas so that their fisheries resources are preserved and they have the best chance possible of maintaining the quality of those reefs into the future. Third, we want to be at the forefront of combining new innovations in renewable energy technology with marine ecotourism. Our vision is to build an advanced expedition vessel that relies solely on renewable energy. A large sailing multi-hull that can travel smoothly and quickly around the Coral Sea using wind power, solar power and converting coconut oil into biofuel. The design of this vessel is the culmination of decades of experience in maritime operations around the Indo-Pacific by the Coral Sea Foundation team. We plan to rewrite the book on what it's possible to achieve with a large sailing multi-hull. The best thing about boats is that they get you to the places with no roads, and there are some phenomenal places with no roads among the thousands of islands and reefs around the Coral Sea. We are glad to have you with us on this journey. I'm Dr Andy Lewis and this is the Coral Sea Foundation.